All right, we got a battle today. Zendikar Rising uh, set booster box. This should be pretty cool. Um, it's between Greg and Michael. Both gentlemen were kind enough to make $69 donations to my uncle's GoFundMe. And with that, I said, baby, we're going to get you up into one of these nasty, 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 nasty battles. So we're going to battle it out between these two. And also on Instagram, if you guys get on Instagram, um, I'm actually, I'm, this is going to be broken on, on this video, but if you get on Instagram, uh, link in the description. Yeah, I'm going to be doing one of these battles for fans. A regular, normal, everyday fan. Winner gets the Expedition Box Topper. May the value forever be on your side. Good luck, gentlemen. Starting things off with Greg. <sighs> Battles are fun. Haven't had one of these in a while. I think I'm going to do for the battle what uh, I think we're going to factor in a dollar fifty and up. It has to be $1.50 or above or it does not get factored into the video. So you'll, there will be more value in this set um, or for, in the box than what we pull. But only things over $1.50 are going to be factored in. Good luck, my ninjas. Cleansing Wildfire, cool card. And the Nimble Trap Finder. But any rare does count. Remember, rare or mythics, regardless, will count. And Attended Healer. Bada skadoosh. Lash out. There you go. And this slot, will, um, no matter what it is, will count also. Is there a foil in every pack? If there is, yeah, we're going to count foils as well. So there you have it. All right, so that's the first little yuha, the little yuha for Greg, Michael. Can you answer that, Michael? I think you're already uh, already ahead before you even open a pack. <laughs> uh, fearless fledging, what ifs? Inscription of ruin. All right, some value, not much. These inscriptions, maybe they'll take off, maybe not. Coveted prize. All right, all right. And turn timber ascetic. Maybe I won't. Maybe we shouldn't count the foils. The, f the foil value in this is going to be really freaking low. So no matter what, it, we're just going to do it. No matter what, it has to be over a dollar fifty. Okay. No matter what, even if it's a foil, the rares as always will be factored in. But these, the foils aren't worth crap. Not many of them are. Ruin crab. Maybe is it over buck fifty? If not, it's going to be there soon. All right. Skyclave squiddy. Sure, Nissa of Shadowed Bows. Give it a couple months, this will be worth like probably five bucks. But right now, I'm not looking so hot there, Gregors. Utility knife and one of these cards. All right, nothing nuts. Over to Michael. Over to Michael. All right, we're going to factor in every foil. Okay. Whoa, hey, look at that. That shows up. These signature cards are going to uh, count no matter what also. They're just special, so we count these as well. There's Anna. All right, very, very cool. Nice signature art card. Rapid bite. Come on, give me something good. Flab brush fire, this, that, and the other. Not a whole lot in the uncommon slot. Clearwater pathway. Basically making up the majority of the set's value are these pathways. Akum Hellhound. Foil. And that's all she wrote. Okay. Uh, right now, I think Michael is ahead. But not by much. But not by much. Okay, not by much. Not by much. You guys like battles? Battles are fun, if you ask me. Rari Disruption might be a buck fifty and up, maybe. If not now, it will be. Undo Inversion counts. With Corheim Chronicler, not what you wanted to see in that, uh, in that, uh, in the foil. Cut to ribbons. About a bang, cutting ribbons. There's your little throwback card. Greg might have taken it up a notch. Man, these set, um, <laughs> the Zendikar Rising set is terrible. If you're gonna buy Zendikar Rising. I highly suggest buying a sealed collector booster box before the price hits 250. And we're nearing that, and it's going to be over 250 very, very soon. Not long ago, they were like a buck, a buck ninety. I bought a whole shit ton of them. Um, well, six of them. <laughs> Malachi Rebirth, bada basurish. All right, that's some money. Lotus Cobra, welcome to the house. There you go. Michael, I think is is leading right now. With that being said, Inscription of Abundance and Spitfire Alzac in the foil. Ooh, Ulvenwald Mysteries shows up. This shows up too many times. I'm just, you know, it just kind of gets my my bundles all on a burndle, you know? My bunchies all on a crunchy. You know, every time I see that, I just can't, I can't help it, man. I just can't help it. I don't know what it is. It's just, you know? I thought that said mana drain. I'm like, yeah, right. I said, yeah, right, baby. All right, come on. Kazaa, Royal Chaser. Mm, 
Dreadworm. Mm -mm. That was pretty freaking terrible. I'm moving this camera up a little bit so you guys know. So everyone's well aware we are moving the camera up a notch. Um, who are we on? We are definitely on Michael. Michael, come on, baby. All right, time to step this game up. Michael said, I'm not going to be a little biscuit. I'm going to pull something good here, baby. I'm going to pull something good for my country. That's right. What do they do? Inscription of insight. Mm. I don't know about that, Michael. Oh, yeah. Michael. Joey Moss called it. Big step right direction for Michael with Omnis Locus of Creation and a foil brush fire elemental looking gorgeous, baby. Looking gorgeous. What a freaking pack. Greg's got to get back at him. Battles are always alphabetical order, so you guys know. Battles always alphabetical order. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Now we got a battle. Greg, you got to do something quick, baby. You got to do something quick. Your tactics are freaking weak in the streets, dude. Squad commander. Mm, more like squad commando and everyone's laughing. Expedition skulker. Mm, more like expedition bulker. All right. Combat damage explained. Back over to Michael, who is the kingpin of this battle. He is just knocking boots right now with value. He's up there. I guess he's at about like 18 to 20 bucks right now. Ruin Crab. Feed the Swarm. Shatter Skull Smashing. Showing on up. Showing on up. Shatter Skull Smashing. Bada bing. And the Inordinate Rage. Wow. Greg, you're getting your, uh, your stuff pushed in right now. It's not looking very good for Greg. Greg is definitely down on his freaking luck right now. Let's see if he can do anything else. Foil planes, probably not over a dollar fifty. Probably not over a dollar fifty. For this set, I really should have done a dollar. I can't just make changes to the rules as we go though. But it should be like a dollar and up for this one because there's not much value. I don't think there's any uncommons over a dollar fifty. Might be like two or three. Oh well. Valkyrie exploration, pretty sweet card. Amazing, amazing art on that. Without a freaking doubt, that is beautiful. And rabid bite foil for Greg. Okay. So a whole lot of shit poops there. Michael, step it up, pal. Step it up a notch, would you? Step it up here. Step it up. You're already kicking the crap out of Greg because Greg's got nothing. Sky clay. Ooh. Branch cloth pathway. That is some solid value right there, my friend. We're still, yeah, okay. There you go. The nice branch cloth with a dauntless un unity. Mm and beseech the queen that's a nice one to pull one of my favorite tutor cards it sure is beseech the queen nice pull michael is smacking the hell out of greg let's see what is up inside the zendikar rising expedition oh gosh what are you guys battling for to be awesome that's what oh raise razor razor verge thicket very nice crazy bend on that there you go. Nice little benditure. But you are battling out for that. That's got to be like 20, 25 bucks. That's a nice card, man. Okay. We'll put that right there. That's what the battle's all about. Gregor's. Let's do it. Greg is so incredibly far behind that there's probably no chance he will win this. <laughs> um, there is slim to none chance. He'd have to pull a rabbit out of a hat right now. And he's got a hunger. Oblivion's hunger in the foil. Foils do look nice. Greg, I'm rooting for you, but dude, you are looking you are looking like a fool with your pants on the ground. Looking like a fool with your pants on the ground. Okay, come on, anything. Kazandu Mammoth for Michael. Oh my god. Greg, I think it's time to close shop, pal. You have gotten obliterated here. There's a foil Tanjoro snare caster. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Greg, dude, this is just looking bad. Can we get a can we get a, can we get some F in the comments for Greg? Just for just for failure. Oh man. World Sculptor showing no freaking signs of value. Blood, blood beckoning just to add some insults for the bulk piles. Man, that Razor Verge ticket sure looks good, don't it, Greg? It sure does look good. Michael's like, I'm taking that baby home. We are running away with it. He's like, we are running away with that. So, Sorge, this guy. Bala GED Recovery, that's over a buck fifty, if I'm not mistaken. I hope. Otherwise, that's bad. Undo Inversion. Mm-hmm. And Kite Sail Cleric Foil. <sighs> Greg, please. The magic gods are begging you to, to make any attempt to come back here. Re redeem what, what little 
belief we have in you. Sure, it's a raging aisle. That's not the way to do it. With a Seagate Banneret. If he pulls a really, really good foil mythic, I think Greg can actually come back. He could. I mean, but all I know right now, it's like the value on this side has got to be, just a guess, probably about $13 to Greg, maybe $14. Michael's probably around $35. That's my, that may be 40. That's my guess. Oh boy. <laughs> oh my goodness. Michael, you got some crabs. That's right. You got a crab. Angel Heart Carver Chronicler with Shepherd of Heroes. Beautiful, beautiful foil there. That does look really nice though. Come on. And a Fabricate from N10. Search your library for an artifact card, reveal it, and put it into your hand and shuffle. That's probably worth a few pennies right there. Probably like at least, at least two bucks at most. Eight, if I had to guess. Yeah, that would be my guess. Any tutor card's really cool. Any tutor card's good. Oh boy. Oh boy, some more junk, some more junk. Oh my gosh. Dude is getting oozed on for freaking sure. And the Gruel Dress Muck Lord. <sighs> they got the Lashweed Lurker of Bulk. There you go. Greg, the peasants rejoice, huh? Greg's like, I can't believe I'm in this now. I know Greg's thinking this was a, this went for a good cause, so I'm just I'm just cool to be up in here. I'm cool to be just up in here, feeling that awesome sauce. Blood Chief's thirst. There was a time that was over a buck fifty. Not sure if it still is. Should be, maybe it will be. Relic Robber double rare pack for Michael with the Master of Winds double farts right there. It's double toots right there. Fissure Wizard. Love the name of that card. There's the foil Fissure Wizard, and that's it. Dang, Gregor's. Losing never felt so good, huh, Greg? Foil Forest. Never. All foils are going to count. Foil Forest. Oh, boy. Journey to Oblivion. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Null Priest of Oblivion. You are in Oblivion right now. You have been oblivionated. See Floor Stalker. Foil. And that's it. It looks... <sighs> this is bad. Um... Battles are fun. Battles are a lot of fun. But when you get ye, the living crap kicked out of you over and over again, it kind of takes the fun away, you know? And Michael's over here just throwing it down. Like $2 here, $4 here. Uh, foil nice over here. A little bit of that. One of these list cards in the back, you know? He's just like literally pouring out value left and freaking right. Left and freaking right. All right, Greg. If Greg turns this around, I will be freaking blown away. If Greg turns this around and wins, I don't think it's possible, but stranger things have happened on this channel. Stranger, th ooh, Skewed Swarm, that's a step in the right direction. You got a lot of value to recover, man. And uh, Palaka, Palaka, Predation Foil. You have a lot of ground to cover, a lot of value to make up for. Michael has to bomb on these next four packs. There's a foil island. That's not helping. It's not helping at all. And Greg has to just, like, come through the roof, man. His girlfriend hopes he does. Amiria's Call. Mm. Okay. Highborn Vampire. Man, these foils, they really printed way too many foils. Dude, the foils are just worthless. And most foils are worth less than non-foils. That's how many foils are out there now. It's redunculous. You really got to get, like, an extended art foil for it to be worth anything nowadays. Spring Mantle Cleric, the Warrior, Grasp, and that's that's a, that's sad. Like, times have really changed. Valakut Exploration. Valakut Exploration. There you go. Some value. Nissa's Zendikon. A nice worthless foil for my buddy Greg over there. Greg, can you beat that worthless foil? He's like, I sure as hell can, Joey. Watch this. Watch this. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, Luminarchus Pirate. Okay, that's like a buck or something. Seagate Colossus, cool art on that, but ultimately worthless. Oh boy, this is looking really, really bad. This is looking really bad. Guys, it's hard to make good content when one person gets obliterated. You know, it's, <laughs> I'm keeping it 100 with you. It's like, what do I say here? Greg's over here looking like a fool with his pants on the ground. You know, he's doing nothing. He's not impressing anybody. There's no chance in, there's no chance in hell he's going to recover. 
zero value, zero excitement. He's on to his almost his last pack over here. Greg, I hope your life is nothing like the way you battled today. Like, if it is, more Fs in the comments need to be dropped for Greg, who's taking the ultimate beatdown on Joey Moss's Pound Town of the Century. That's right. Um, Arc Priest of Bulk and Aura Skyclave Hierophant. Has Greg even opened a double rare pack? I don't even know that he has. I can't even say that he has. Well, there's Valakut Exploration in the foil. Wow. <sighs> Greg, you would have to pull the most expensive card in foil out of this set right now. There's n no other option. It's that or complete bust for you. Um, that or you lose. You pull the most expensive card in foil out of the set, you have a chance of winning. You don't, you absolutely lose. Cleric of Chill Depths, Synchronized Spellcraft, Shatter Skull Charger. Oh, this has been a bad break as well. Royal Eruption. Hmm. Mischievous Quanar. Is that worth anything? Face down some Morph card. That's probably not worth shit. All right, just reading it, I could tell right away. All right, Greg. That, my friend, uh, I'm sorry. Greg, you lost very, very badly. There's a foil swamp just for Michael. Do we even have to add this up anymore? Can we just can we just turn the video off? But, <laughs> there you go. Some more value. Michael, a way to go, bud. <laughs> a split current. Now here he's litho forming, sure. <laughs> there you go. And a hash eep oasis. Uh, not a big fan of the set boosters or the regular draft of this product. But I am a big fan of those collector boosters, let me tell you. All right, guys, appreciate you tuning in. I'm Joy Moss, Bad Boy MTG. Leave a pity like for these guys. They earned. Greg, that was the absolute worst anyone has ever done on this channel. You had 15 booster packs. If it wasn't for a $5 Scoot Swarm, you barely would have hit $10. Now, I know this is not Greg's fault, but this is very, this is terrible. I don't know how, there's no sugarcoating this. This, this is very sad. And had this been five years ago when foils were not as abundant as they are now with the collector boxes, tons of reprints there, the set boosters just added foils in every single pack. This probably, Greg might have had 25, 25 to 30 bucks in value. But with the overprinting, man, it is really taking a toll on the value of Magic the Gathering cards. I love the idea of collector boxes, I really do. But I'm hoping Wizards of the Coast figures out something else they can do so the value of foils does not continue to tank. What are your guys' thoughts on this? Congrats to the winner. Oh my goodness, this was an absolute savage beatdown. Michael, I'll be getting these out to you soon. Anyone else who is brave enough to participate in one of these battles, check out the link in the description. Hopefully your luck is better than Greg. Greg has had good luck on the channel before, so that's pretty sweet. But, oh my smothering tithe. Patreon for battles, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Leave a like. Joy Moss, Bad Boy MTG. Oh my. Making up for teenage crime. Making up for teenage crime.